bring your attention to this file that I got here, Exhibit A. And I'm going to take you to the main page of it, which is right here. It's called Beautiful Women. Take a look at all of them. And do you notice anything out of the ordinary? Anything a little bit suspicious? Well, I won't name the person or describe them, but somebody that I had asked had said, well, yeah, I noticed there aren't too many minorities represented. And they're absolutely right. To be specific, there's only that one right there and that one down there. But the truth of the matter is that when I first bought this magic trick, there were no minorities. Well, ostensibly there weren't. You can never tell just by looking. Some of them might have been light-skinned or mulatto. But I had to change this situation. And so this was an easy fix with cut and paste. And now it looks beautiful. And it's going to help out the young lady's self-esteem. So that when they see a trick, they can see themselves in the trick. Now just a little background information without getting too demonstrative. I know the person that created this magic trick originally. And if you walk outside of their magic store and look at their car, you're going to notice a bumper sticker. And the bumper sticker says, Trump for 2016. And also, when you walk in the store, you're going to notice that that person is wearing a hairpiece that looks very much just like Trump's hair piece. And so when they designed this beautiful woman magic trick, this was their opinion of what beautiful woman looked like. And that one and that one were not in it. So if you're one of those people that don't believe in coincidences, it's saying a lot. 